Hello everyone, and in one of my previous videos I showed you how to make a dynamic cube map for your game. And in this tutorial I'm gonna show you one fix for this dynamic cube maps. So the problem was, uh, so when your object has uh, children in it so so this is so this this is a parent and this is a children it's a children of this object so that's what I mean now and and um, when you enter it mm, in a zone of cube map only the parent object was affected by this script of of switching uh, between cube maps now I will show you what I have here so I have my camera and my camera has rigid body uh, empty object empty game object with rigid body uh, set to kinematic and it has two cube maps and I'm gonna show you what I mean here what I'm trying to say so this object is simple box with collider um, and with a cube map but this cube map is empty it's blank and like this one they are they have empty blank cube maps and what will happen here so uh, I will show you now what will happen so we have our let's just say it's a pistol and we all already have an error now it say that there is no renderer attached to that car so that car um, so really I'm gonna show you what it says about so this car doesn't you know has really a renderer a component because it's a group and it tries to to access a renderer component of this group and this group doesn't has it so and usually it should stop it should stop um, making a dynamic a cube map but instead it will address to children objects now and uh, and this object also has children objects so this cube and this cube so now we will see what will happen uh, clear okay let's just look once again so now we are going to this place and we can see that there is no render attached to camera because camera is parent object we can see here two error messages now three four five and this is the six the first message error message was uh, was because this car was in zone of this of this cube map so here and now we will have only six errors only six errors and uh, error will appear only once when our object is entering uh, this zone only once and never again so and I think it's a fix you know I think it's fixed you know uh, anyway uh, there is an error but I could not fix it normally so you know uh, I wanted those error to not appear at all but I cannot so and this is how it work so dynamic cube maps of children objects
and let me show you uh, the scripts it's not to waste your time so mm, this is our cube maps um, I mean this is the point of cube maps so it, you can s you can see that it's empty so this is rigid body oh mm, I mean this is just a landmark it's just for tests so if you kill this cube it, it will not change anything so this is just for just for test but really landmark is here this is empty game object that has cube map script so let's go to the script and see what uh, changes I made I committed to the script launching modern develop version number 401 and <coughs> And here we go. Very simple script for cube map, cube map points. So, uh, if we, when something enters this, this zone of trigger, it uh, checks for its collider of the object that enters this zone uh, so mm, if uh, this you know uh, so you no know, I try to fix this uh, the problem with errors this way but I couldn't fix it so uh, so mm, for each renderer of the object that enters this zone we take a cube map and change it to the to the value that um, that um, is set in our cube map this you know, this cube map point and also we take a children of objects that enter this zone and we do the same to the children objects this is a simple you know mm, script I guess that's all now you can see it does work but uh, you know I still cannot understand how to get rid of those you know errors they, they, they are still here maybe you will help help me out with your comments okay anyway thank you for watching and have a good time bye bye